Welcome back, YouTube. Man, talk 24-7 here. Going over the Saints game, man. Yeah, the Saints took the L. They lost. And everyone's blaming this dude, Marcus Williams. And he should be blamed, man. What What was that? For real? Dude, talking about he, he didn't want to get pass interference or he didn't want to. Yeah, pass interference is the worst possible thing that could happen instead of a walk-off touchdown. Man, it was just... It was crazy, man. I've been saying, start of the year, Saints going to win the Super Bowl, Saints going to win, Saints going to win, and it's just tough seeing Drew Brees go out like that, man. But, you know, I was, I'm trying to defend Marcus Williams, man, for real, because, I mean, he had a pick in that same game. I know a lot of people forgot about it, but he had a pick in the same game, and it's just, man, I ain't seen him play that bad since Raheem Moore. Not even gonna lie, man. I ain't seen him play that bad since Raheem Moore, and it's just it's baffling. But this guy's a rookie, so I want to give him a benefit of the doubt. But that's just that ain't football, man. You know the man that just ain't football, man. For real, this dude. I had to watch the replay. I, I'm just sitting back watching in shock. Like, okay, when are they gonna throw the flag? All right, when are they gonna blow the whistle? Like, this obviously did just happen. You know, we won the game. I'm talking to my family, talking about, yo, we got the Eagles up next, and then that happened. So, tough way to lose, man, but only consolation is, uh, it was the second round, really, man. Uh, the deeper you go, the more the loss hurts, and I don't know how it feels to lose a Super Bowl. I don't. Now, I know how it feels to win one, but yeah, I mean, Marcus Williams, man, like, he's still my boy, man. I mean... The way I see it, man, he made one big play and then one really, really bad play. But he's a rookie. Man is only 20, 21 years old, man. He's going to get better. He had four interceptions as a rookie. So, I mean, this guy's a pretty good player, man. And that's why it's just even more. It just don't even feel real, man. Honestly, man, just, I mean, it just don't feel real. I mean, it's just. It's just embarrassing, man. They had 25 seconds left and got a touchdown. They had 25 seconds left and got a touchdown. But that's just how it is, man. Uh, I I honestly believe we were going to win the Super Bowl, man. I wasn't just saying that. I honestly believed it. I thought it was going to be our year. But it's a team game, man. And you need all 53 or 46 or how, however many players play, man. You need them all to play good. I mean, a block punt, a... A whiff, you know, you just, I mean, it, it's it's a team game, man. It was tough seeing Drew go down like that. It really was, but that's really all I got to say, man. I mean, the Vikings defense, they played good in the first half, but I thought going in it was overrated. Michael Thomas, uh, I thought Xavier Rose overrated. Michael Thomas started, you know, catching passes all over him. So, I don't know, man. I think Drew still got one year left in him, uh, maybe two. Uh, I saw that interception he threw, man. He ain't get enough arm strength underneath it. So that's kind of troubling, man. You know, arm strength is the first thing that goes. So I don't know, man. But, you know, defense and the run game, we had a great draft. Honestly, man, we overachieved. Not many people had us going this far. And uh, just prepare for next season, man. That's, that's really all I can say about that. But Kamara, we got Williams. Uh, Lattimore, I mean, uh, that lineman, man, I'm blanking on his name, Henderson, Hickerson, I'm blanking on his name, and that dude, uh, we had a linebacker, I mean, we had a great draft class, so we can build on this man, and, uh, just, I guess, ride you to his arm falls off.